Hi friends, today we are going to talk about this transaction BD20. So what is BD20? So BD20 takes care of any inbound processing items ready for packaging. So you might say, well, what will it do really? So what I'm going to do is basically it will post any IDOCs that is stuck. So I'm now going to do, um, I just select not equal to, okay, just to make life easier. I'll put a created date probably of. Uh, March 1st and and I'll put an end date um, this and we'll execute and uh, oh, in an end. so let's get some more well, probably April 2019 so they'll get something okay so here you can see now it's processing so it's saying that five or six there's just some termination because there's some problem with the processing so let's go back this is something you know this is called bab jump so back again so we don't have here and i'll just change it to ida passes and i'll change it to 2018 probably 2018 till 2019 probably uh, January 1st and I put 2019 okay so 18 to 19 and let me execute just like this we don't have anything that's fine now I'll change the IDOC status and and I'll make it not equal okay. and I'll execute and I'm getting no data here also so that's a problem so we'll change the date to 2017 no data again oops 2011 and no data so it seems like we don't have any data but uh, here once you have some data inbound processes for IDOCs ready for passing you, you can process this and when you are stuck and you have this I button in any of this it basically goes through the documentation of what it really does so this is report for processing inbound or not passed to the application immediately so this 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 will take so this report forwards all IDOCs with 64 status ready to be passed okay so basically it takes care of this so so since we didn't have much data here we cannot execute but if you had data and you are stuck at 64 status you can use the code, code, code is bd20 so that's it stay tuned to the channel and happy learning thank you and have a great